Hello guys, welcome to the new tutorial. Today we're gonna be importing some custom fonts into our Unreal Engine project, so let's just go with it. First thing, to find our um, font, we're gonna go to the control panel, we're gonna go to appearance and personalization, and we're gonna open fonts. So when we are here, we can select the one we like. Obviously you have other, um, other websites where you can download some fonts, uh, but if you're gonna release it in the game, you need to be sure that you have proper license for that. So we're just gonna take Comic Sans in our example. And for the first one, we're gonna click yes. And for the other ones, we're gonna click no. I want to create folder so it's not like messy like this. So we're just gonna go to fonts. And we're gonna open Comic Font. So here we will, okay, we're gonna add the bold one first. I, this is bold. This one is italic, and the last one is I should I think it should be bold italic, and we click save and we can close now. So we successfully imported our font, and now if we go to the, uh, we can just create some simple uh, user interface widget blueprint to check it out if our font works. So we're gonna put canvas. I call it test. Oh, text. We're just gonna anchor it to mid, doesn't even matter, it's just text purpose. Font test, we're gonna type font test and we're gonna go under font here. We're just gonna simply change it to font. So, you remember when I told you to press yes on the first one and no on the other ones? If you pressed yes on every one, every single one, you would have list of all fonts that you imported right but because we pressed no for the other ones now we have types so we have bold bold italic italic that's what we did we literally set it up so we can uh, change the font size something like 40 so we have better understanding so we can test bold it's bold bold italic it's bold italic italic light italic so it works perfectly we can go to the game and test that let's just add it to our viewport um, and begin play create widget we're gonna select test and we're just gonna add it to viewport perfect should work now we can go and press play and as you can see we have our new font that we imported custom and there you go that's all for today thank you for watching and bye